everyone welcome to another video in this video we will discuss an important use case related to dataverse and power automate let us take a scenario then i will tell you what is the problem statement and scenario then we will discuss right so i have an entity called as customer agreement right here user can create a new customer agreement by providing details let's say i want to give a name test I can choose a customer from the from the lookup and I can choose a agreement template lookup choose agreement type and select a property lookup and agreement from a date and I can save it once user can save this record initially next requirement is user can upload a PDF document or word document related, related to this agreement now we have created already a word template that user can download right and user can download it plus user can upload that uh, template or word template that is downloaded in this signed agreement column so i can once it is downloaded user can choose the file and upload as an attachment right so this is a file data type column we have you know that in dataverse while creating a new record the file data type cannot be manipulated at the initial save operation after you save the record you can associate a attachment but my requirement is whenever a new customer agreement record is created i want to download it should initiate a power automate on create of this record plus it will download this document associated with this column in power automate for further processing but it happens that when the record is created not necessarily the user immediately uploads the file here the user may take some time he may take five minutes may take 10 minutes depending on his availability but let's say business requirement it it should be max 10 minutes assigned to upload this right that means the uh, the power automate should wait for 10 minutes right but what about if the user forgot to upload in 10 minutes and you have associated a step in the power automate to download it then your power automate will throw error because the power automate will not get the file attached to, to this uh, column right so the requirement is how to handle the wait condition in power automate which will wait till a file is uploaded instead of defining a specific timeline i don't want to specify 10 minutes the power automate will keep waiting till a file is uploaded here in this file data type column for this record the power automate will run on this record creation but keep waiting till the file is available in this attachment who will upload here does not matter but it will keep waiting till the file is having a associated attachment that's what the flow all about today's flow now what I have done let us see so I have written a trigger right this trigger is when a row is added and define my entity this is the change type is added table name is this and organization next I have initialized a variable file available file available is a boolean data type I have taken for this variable and initialized as false okay in power automate if you want to keep waiting for a certain condition to meet you can use a do until loop okay if you click on plus and add an action you can search do until okay this do until loop will help you to define a condition to meet and 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 do the further processing so when i added this do until loop you can define the condition here right 
so i have taken the same do while loop do until loop and define the condition here in do until that create the loop or run the loop until unless file available flag is true that means if the file available variable value is not true keep running the loop what i will do in the loop i'll tell you but the loop will never end till the file available variable is true now in in this very in this loop what i am doing i am making a intentional delay of 1 minute when the loop starts it will keep waiting 1 minute direct 1 minute wait then it will again fetch the data the record associated with the current record right so again it will fetch data directly the uh, trigger will in trigger will trigger will connected to the data set or uh, items in that time but when the power automate triggered you do not have the attachment that's why in the loop i am again fetching the data after 1 minute in the loop if there might be some data in the attachment uh, column so once it will get i am doing another conditional check if the column value is not equal to null if it's not equal to null i am setting the variable file available is true so every 1 minute it will keep getting the latest data from the record and set the value check the uh, file data type file column uh, value whether it is not null if it is not null set the variable as true otherwise keep looping keep looping every 1 minute that means this do until loop will wait till the file is associated or attached in this record if not it will keep looping multiple times with a 1 minute gap and getting the record latest record data and check the condition to set the variable now this is the clue once it is done i am downloading the file using the download a file on or an image using dataverse connector then i can do further processing i can send email or i can do whatever i want to do with this downloaded file but let us test it if it is working fine okay now let me test this loop is introduced to keep waiting for a certain condition to meet now click on save and test now if you want to save and test you have to initiate a action so that it will initiate it will start so go to here and start create create a customer agreement record so that it will start so go here and create a new record let's say test choose a customer agreement template agreement type property agreement date and save it as soon as i save it will start initiating or triggering the flow and let me start a stopwatch click on start we'll check how the power automate will run depending on the loop let us wait the power automate will in initiated yes now it is initiated so it is initiated now the loop is uh, loop started it will keep waiting 1 minute and get latest data so what i'll do i will wait for 5 minutes i have already given the uh, uh, timer here so that whenever it will be 5 minute i will check the power automate how it is behaving then i will upload the file here okay so let us wait now you can see it is already 5 4 minutes right and it is about to 5 minutes and check the power automate the power out automate is still waiting right because we have not uploaded till now the file and it is keep waiting and looping through the conditions now what i will do 
it is already 434 minutes and 30 seconds 30 seconds right so what i'll do let me go here in the record and upload a file in this file column so i'll go here and upload this one let us see once once it is uploaded i'll go to the power automate and check how it behaves so next time when it will get latest data it will get the file column and stop the loop because the condition will meet because the variable file available will be true now it is success so after five minutes four second you see here it waited five minutes four second then it got latest data and the file is downloaded okay now you can check when the first loop started this variable didn't set as true when second loop started the variable didn't set true when fourth loop started it didn't set true but when fifth loop started this set the variable true that's why the loop ended and it exit from the loop and do the rest of the steps so it downloaded successfully because file is available so this is how you can manage it if there is a requirement to requ requirement that power automate should wait till a condition is met okay so thanks everyone watching this video uh, see you next time if there is any question let me know bye everyone